Civil rights leader Malcolm X will be honored this year with his induction into the Nebraska Hall of Fame and a permanent place at the state capitol. To mark this historic moment, a Lincoln artist has spent countless hours perfecting a sculpture to honor that Omaha native and activist. 1011's Kendall Lanier sat down with him and she joins us live tonight in the studio with this story. Kendall. Madison Cool, Nathan Murray was selected from a pool of national artists to portray Malcolm X's legacy and what he stood for locally and beyond. It's bigger than just art for Nathan Murray, but an opportunity to educate Nebraskans. I hope that they get a little bit of a sense for who Malcolm X was, and I hope that they also can engage with the piece and that it'll create interest in them learning a little bit more about what he did, what he stood for. Murray started the project in March by studying Malcolm X closely to understand the little details. I have to look at lots of photos and really just study the dimensions of the face uh, in order to capture that likeness because that's one of the hardest things to do is to really make something look like a person. With a person as notable as Malcolm, it was important for Murray to be intentional on how he is posed. He spoke with Malcolm's daughter in addition to others on her desire that her father be portrayed doing the work of God. Really, I had wanted to put Malcolm in a thoughtful pose, kind of like this, um, but after after um, winning the, the, the commission, I came up with the idea of just bringing it out like he's in dialogue with uh, the people that are looking at it. The clay artist of 15 years wanted to depict Malcolm X in the stage of his life after he returned from Mecca in Saudi Arabia. He just came back um, willing to work with anyone. He wanted to continue the work. He wanted to continue that fight for for equality and, and justice. Facial hair became a part of the activist's signature look once he returned to the U.S. What starts as wet clay will eventually become bronze for its final state. Patience has been a necessary skill for Murray during this process. Basically, if a crack starts happening, it means that um, it's not just on the outside. Usually, it's, it's usually all the way on the inside. So there was a point where I had to just take the arm off and I had to re kind of work the clay and then stick it back together. One of Murray's favorite quotes from Malcolm X stays with him as he works on the piece. I believe in human beings and that all human beings should be respected as such, regardless of their color. Malcolm X will be the first African-American inducted into the Nebraska Hall of Fame. Uh, you know, when kids come to the state capitol, they're seeing all of these busts that uh, represent these important Nebraskans. So I think it's really important, you know, that people will see somebody that looks like them, you know. I think that's a really important part of the piece as well. Once the piece is complete, it will be on display to view in the Nebraska Hall of Fame starting tentatively in May, Malcolm's birth month.